Here with Kendall Ellis, who just won the American Track Sleeping Four Hundred. Did he get the best start out? Start, but you closed very well. What was the mission coming to like a lower meet like this? Yeah, I mean the most challenging, but coaches really wanted to get my race pattern down. But the more races I have, the more comfortable I get, and the better it'll get. So I'm happy with the body too. What's it, what's it like to coming off of like coming off your world record on that DMR team and then adjusting to like getting back to running like the open? What's like the biggest challenge? Uh, I don't know you before, so I'll just become a relay anyways, and it's just harder, feels harder. So kind of just getting comfortable in that again, just finding my race patterns with different wind doors, doing two laps, it's just one. So I really, really have to stick to the race plan and, and execute. It was pretty windy out here too. Um, what are some of the adjustments that you felt like you had to make in the race to that wind and everything? Yeah, super windy on the back track, so coming, to, coming off that first curve, it was like, you know, you're going to feel wind, are you going to have it against you, so you're going to have to push a little extra, put in some more effort. So just being conscious and aware of it. Alright, and also how do you feel about the new It's so cute. It's super cute, y'all, isn't it? I love it. We have different uniforms. Different styles, this color is it, so I'm real cute on the track. I'm cute and winning, so I'm not. Hey, look good, feel good, run good. Appreciate you. Thank Appreciate you. you.